to Second Corinthians chapter five, if we could. But uh, before we look at this passage together, I want us to pray because the world is running out of time. We may think you know, we've got lots of time. Let me tell you, we are running out of time. And there's a world that needs Jesus. It's getting darker by the day. Um, Nelson mentioned that I was in Tasmania. I mean, talk about dark. They have a festival every year down there called Dark Mofo. It happens at the time of the winter solstice. Swim naked in the Derwent River, over a thousand of them. When the police went to the, sort of sort this out, but they were told, lay off. A councillor said, no, they leave them alone, this is okay. Uh, the, the man who organises it, you go to his museum, in his car park, it's got God. He's God. And next door, his wife, Mrs. God, sort of thing. Blasphemous, cross upside down, rolling around in animal gizzards one year. I mean, how, how dark can we get? But, uh, I mean, it's right across the world. And John makes it very plain in the end of time, out of the mouth of the dragon, out of the mouth of the beast, out of the mouth of the false prophet, out of the mouth of those three beasts are going to come demons. 